set. You all ready? Okay, well, thank you very much for, uh, for coming this morning on, on short notice. I do want to make uh, uh, a few preliminary comments, and uh, Eric doesn't have a prepared text. He's here really to, to answer any questions that you have. Um, you know, as you know, uh, this, this uh, tragic event has just occurred, and, and we're, we're putting this news conference together on, in short order. So I want to emphasize that we're here, or I'm here, in the capacity of being a very close personal friend of, of, of Eric's, and I'm not here in my legal capacity, uh, but this was just a convenient forum to, to have this uh, news conference and, uh, on short order. Um, as you can appreciate, and, and you'll gain a better appreciation when you uh, ask Eric questions and he answers, uh, this is a very difficult time for Eric. Um, uh, to use words like shattered or devastated don't come close to uh, expressing uh, how tough this is for Eric. Uh, this is like losing a member of your family. Um, but uh, but Eric understood that there was uh, uh, you know a need to 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 answer questions. So I hope that you appreciate by having this uh, news conference and giving you the opportunity to ask every question you want. When we're done today, um, uh, he will not be answering any other questions. Uh, so he can obviously deal with the, the grieving process. Um, and um, I want to just uh, uh, tell you one, one story about Eric that I think uh, Canadians should, 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 should know, and I don't mean to embarrass you, Eric, but it's something that uh, is important to me. Um, it, just before the Beijing Olympics, uh, Eric uh, and I were up at his house in the Schaumburg area, and we were uh, walking through uh, the field and uh, Eric stopped me, uh, and it was an amazing moment. Words can't come close to describe it, but he said, I want to win a gold medal for Canada. I want to win a gold medal for my country. I want my country to be proud of me. And he went out with Hicks dead and got a gold medal. If any of you were there at that moment could feel the depth and passion in Eric to win a gold medal for his country, uh, it would bring tears to your eyes, and it brought tears to, to my eyes. And I just thought I'd share that, that moment with you and uh, uh, open it up for questions, and Eric will be happy to uh, answer them. Yes, it's been a few days very difficult. Premièrement, de prendre la décision de, de venir ici à Toronto ou pas. Euh, C'est euh, quelque chose qui s'est passé très vite. Et euh, à la fin, je suis très content d'avoir fait l'effort de venir ici à Toronto, euh, de venir vous parler, de, de, de répondre à vos questions et de, 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 devenir, de, de devenir devant mon public canadien. Euh, qui euh, déjà hier à la première ouverture de, du concours de Toronto était très supportif. Well, um, it was an international show in Italy in Verone. Uh, it's a sh it's a competition that uh, I've been part of before. Uh, Extend jumped very well the first day. Uh, jumped very well the second day. Um, and actually jumped very well uh, the last day uh, and uh, just um, as he finished around uh, just collapsed um, and uh, at this point uh, he uh, sure made sure that I was okay and uh, just sort of fell beside me and uh, and everybody the staff uh, that were in charge there were very quick to respond and uh, to make sure that uh, he was attended to the best that, uh, of their ability. Can you talk to us about the bond between yourself, Eric, and the sports and how you feel about that? Eric, for can, can I ask you to, not to trouble you too much, if you could shift more over to a second yeah. position? Well, um, I think it's... Um, you know, when you have a horse that, uh, I think anybody that's ridden a horse at our level, uh, what these horses do for us is incredible. Um, we, uh, they, like Tim said, they become part of our family. 
um, they, um, you know, they really change our life. Uh, it's a sport that we choose because we love it, but it's a sport that we chose because we also love the animal. So, um, you know, it's not like breaking a hockey stick or, or breaking a tennis racket. For us, it's really, uh, we become very close to these animals and have great respect for what they do for us. Uh, we're in the limelight with our horses, but uh, a horse like Ixted uh, for sure changed my career, and uh, it's, uh, it's, yeah, it's something that, uh, you know, the, 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 the history is there to prove it, and um, yeah, for me it meant everything. Well, um, you know, we all have to take a step back, uh, you know, to, to um, for me, uh, at the moment, I have other very good horses, uh, none of them which I think, uh, honestly, uh, I have some that could do the Olympic, I don't have one of the caliber, of the caliber that I need to do the Olympic with. Um, and I've always said, you know, it's, I've, I've been there once on an incredible horse. Uh, I would never go back on less than a, than a very good horse and having a very good chance. I'll do anything I can to help Canada win another medal. But we have till December 31st to acquire a new horse um, for the Olympic. I think uh, I have wonderful owners and great support. I think there'll be a lot of talk uh, into what we do from that, from 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 that, from this day on. I think uh, we all have to take a step back and look. It's not easy to find a horse of a caliber of an Ixted. Uh, you know, if you ask me, I did not know that Ixted was Ixted when he was seven or eight years old. You know, I think we made a great team together, and uh, so. I mean, we're sort of running out of time, but I know that I have the support behind me to make it possible. And uh, for me, it would be another dream come true to ride at, an, at another Olympic. Um, so we'll see what we can do. And how hard was it to ride uh, last night? Um, <laughs> it's... Um, you know, it's 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 hard. Uh, I'm not uh, I'm not really here to compete this week. I'm here for the Canadian public. I'm here to uh, honor Extend, and uh, that's why I came. So, Eric, pour être nous expliquer un peu le lien que tu avais avec Extend parce que les gens de notre public à nous, c'est pas des gens nécessairement qui connaissent très très bien le sport. C'était quoi ton lien avec Extend? Comment proche vous étiez? Um, bon, le, le, beaucoup de monde disent que le cheval devient, tu deviens un peu comme ton cheval et le cheval devient un peu comme toi quand tu as un rapport très fort avec un cheval. Il faut déjà que tu, tu aies un peu la même personnalité. Je crois qu'on avait une personnalité un peu la même. Uh, et uh, est, on était les deux gagnants, de, on aimait gagner et uh, on avait la même uh, éner énergie qui se transformait dans des choses euh, incroyables.